Hello everyone, this is Darwell20 and welcome to episode 35 of MC Eternal, where today I think I'm making an electrolyzer, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, industrial electrolyzer. Woot! Hooray! Electrolyzer. Uh, now I need bauxite, I believe, right, uh, to, to process into this, because what I need, in order to get my power fist, I need titanium ingots, which come from titanium dust, which come from small piles of titanium dust, which come from bauxite dust in an industrial electrolyzer with empty cells. So we're going to totally want some empty cells from Tech Reborn uh, to help out with what we're making here. That should be cool. Uh, not you, you, you. And then we need bauxite that's going to be crushed. Uh, I assume in a crusher, would that work? No, he might need to go into an enriching factory. Does that sound cool? Bauxite dust. Where do I get you from? Uh, pulverizer can do it. Or the industrial grinder or grinder from Tech Reborn. Or a sag mill. I mean, we could do the grinder from Tech Reborn. I want to say that actually doesn't have a recipe. That's interesting. Industrial grinder sounds like the kind of thing that's going to need a multi-block. And just because I don't feel like dealing with multi-blocks... You know, magic blocks are not like the best thing in the world, but also multi-blocks, also not the best thing in the world. How are you doing over here, Power? Hey, I've seen better days. I turned off my uh, miner outside because uh, somebody's been busy gobbling up all my power. Not the end of the world per se, but you know, trying to keep things a little bit taken care of. Sweet aluminum. What are you processing? Oh, you've got auto input on. Well, that's okay. I don't care. All right, and then bauxite can come over here and be industrial electrolyzed. Oh boy, he he takes a lot of power, doesn't he? <laughs> 576. Okay, so what if we got a flux point here? Let me just borrow this one. Just curious, if I stuck you on there, would you be able to just absorb all the powers? I mean, he's doing better. A little bit better. Now for giggles. All the sides. Haha. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, uh, the tick acceleration went away. But I mean, he's doing a little bit better power transfer now, at least. Yeah, I. Not great. He looks like he just doesn't want to take all the powers, is what, it, is what it comes down to. But hey, we've got titanium, and that's cool. And some pulverized aluminum, too, which don't hurt nothing. So between episodes, you'll note that I made the power leggings, helmet, and boots. I was waiting for you guys to make the power armor chest plate, which I can do now, which is cool. And now we've got a full suit of power armor from Machine Muse's modular power mod. That is cool, modular armor. So I could just, like, equip this stuff, but I don't think... I don't think, no, uh, at a tinker table, right. So that's where we need to get the power armor dude going on, right? And that's where we need to go to Ratlantis. So I think I figured out how to do this though. Uh, looking at Ratlantis in JEI, I've discovered that we're looking for a chunky cheese token, one in 10,000 drop rate from rats. And you can make them from mysterious tokens, which need mysterious token fragments, which I know I've gotten a few of from killing rats, right? Um, however, in in looking at, and that's right, you should probably still be on for now. Um, in looking at my, my, my output chest here, which by the way, I hooked up to a trash can because it was just getting stupidly full. I don't think I've gotten any of those of those rat drops so there's two things we could do we could try and capture a rat dude and see if spawning him over and over again causes that drop to occur or or we could spawn rats over and over again and hope for that drop to occur or um what we could do and by the way i'm going to turn you off i just wanted to clear out i think for the time being i'm going to turn you off on the east on insert for a minute that's unfair yeah so the other thing we could do besides trying to spawn them, uh, which is not too terrible, is we could buy it out of the quest shop for 3,000 
which is not a terrible amount. Like, that's reasonable. I think I've even got that much, right? I've got 4,000. So technically, I could do that right now. Um, so we did some things between episodes. Oh, yay, a music disc. Hooray. All right. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Where else are quest tandems? I think it was just all the, the power armor that I just made. Ooh, spear hook launcher. That's neat. I'll figure out what that is in a minute. Let's see what other loots we get. Uh, oh, an explorer's hat. Nice. Oh, an ender doohickey. All right, cool. Cactus sword from Stupid Things. Prick your enemies and yourself to death. <laughs> Funny. Oh, look how cool I look. What's up, guys? How's it going? And spear hook launcher from Advanced Hook Launchers. That's cool. Real hook, press Q or X. Pull, right click. Loosen. Left click, boost up, Q or X while pulling, release, left click while. Yeah. Oh, hello. Hey, that's neat. It's like a grapple hook. That's cool. Now, how do we release it? <laughs> left click while holding shift. All right, it's not entirely released though. Boost up. Oh, hello, Q. Q pulls it back in, that's neat. Okay, cool. That's a, that's a neat little gadget. I mean, if not for flight, probably be better. All right, so how are you guys doing? A little better? Getting there. Uh, what I need to do is take accelerate this up because I want my titanium, please. Okay, so we'll smelt up some titanium. I guess you can auto. Well, no, I don't want auto input on you. And you can smelt up that stuff too. And there's your titanium, which means I should be able to make that cool drill now. Um, so we've got the steel drill, which we can now upgrade to the diamond drill which we can now upgrade to the advanced drill, it just needs an iridium alloy plate, which we have, two iridium nuggets, which we have, uh, a couple overclocker upgrades, which needs this. So get me some buckets of water, please. We can pull that off, right? That would be back here somewhere. I've got a little water source. Cool. Uh, you can turn into lots of things, apparently. So you need a pair of overclocker upgrades. Let's just get a bunch of these. Now, why you're not stacking, I'll never know. And we'll hang on to a maybe, well, let's do one more just so we have an even 12. That seems good, right? Um, so realistically, what we want is another one of these drills. So we're going to need the energy flow conduit in a minute here, but we'll figure that out soon. But there's your two overclocker upgrades, right? So that's cool. So now to upgrade this guy, the only thing left um, is the centerpiece here, which is the energy flow conduit, right? So that needs Lapatronic crystals and a few advanced dudes. Let's see what, where we're at with this, right? We've got one advanced dude, right? And so we can make... Ugh, we're going to need more insulated copper cabling. How are you guys? We are out of all the things that need to make that. Cooked up a little bit more, but we're still a little bit low. And then some more iron smelted up into the Tech Reborn iron. So that's close. So let's get three more of these. Let's get uh, tungsten ingots. Oh, that's going to be a tricky one. Tungsten, tungsten, tungsten. Dust comes from where? Do we have anything tungsten-y yet? I assume that this is uh, some form of 
this dude. So the industrial blast furnace can make it. So small piles of tungsten dust, is this what we're looking for? Industrial centrifuge of lava cells or endstone dust. So 16 lava cells will get me a very small amount of tungsten uh, or endstone dust, and we haven't been to the end yet. Hmm. Now, endstone dust... Right, can come from endstone. Starlight transformation can make it happen. We could fluid infuse some ender pearls. Each ender pearl gets me an endstone, but that sounds like a large waste of ender pearls. Right, because we need basically 16 ender pearls. I think I'd rather use 16 lava cells to be fair. So mathing it out real quick, right? Is there no other way to get tungsten dust? I mean, there's tungsten ore in the end, it looks like. Maybe. We don't know that for sure. We don't know that for sure. Right? We don't know that for sure. But maybe we could go visit the end today. Does that sound like fun? Does that sound like fun? I'm going to put a crate with all my to-do list stuff out here because we have a lot of... We have a lot of things to do to get... I thought Machine Muse's modular power suits would be a little bit easier to get into. Um, and it's not. It's not quite as easy as I had hoped. Um, I'm going to put you away. I can put you away. You guys can go home. Should we go hunting for the end? I feel like that's kind of where we're headed. I feel like that's kind of what's about to happen. We could just grab some endstone while we're there and maybe a few other things. I mean, we have a jetpack. We can do that. I don't, I don't see there's any reason we can't do that, right? Let's get some Eyes of Ender, right? Like eight of them. Actually, we probably, well, no. And let's also get a receiver. And let's also get a wireless connector uh, thingy from this guy. And uh, what we'll do is we'll set up a receiver by the end portal once we find it. Cool? So let's go hunt for the end. I was not planning to do this today, but you know what? Sometimes things don't go according to plan. So that direction is the nearest. And I know there's websites you can go to that will tell you, you know, where things are, yada, yada, yada. I'm well aware. Um, no thanks. I'll find it the old fashioned way, throwing ender pearls. Hey, is this the top of one of these tower dudes? Sweet. That is some, that is some, that is some not great loots right there. That is some, that is some uninspiring loots. Still off in this direction. All right. So I think what I'll do is uh, fly off in this direction and head towards about where the, the, the fortress is. And then we'll find our way down to it. Oh, now we're close. Uh, and I know that because I, I went too far. I think we're getting close now. Where'd it go? Did it go down from here? I think it did. Great, we're going right into a right into a thingy. Let's let's try and do this in a less water flowy kind of place. That's, that's neat. Hey, look what I found. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. We found one. Nice. I spy. Is that a, is that a normal vanilla enchantment or is that like a custom one? This is, this is, I presume, a stronghold, right? It looks like one. All right, now we have to do that, uh, find the portal thingy, right? Back shortly once I kind of find it. 
So this is definitely a Dungeons 2 dungeon. And I'm wondering if Dungeons 2 overrides Strongholds or not. Because that is going to get tricky real quick if that's the case. Have I found some stuffs yet? I have. Good. Uh, let's do this, this, this. Put all this junk away. Uh, a little bit nervous that I might be in a weird position here, but we'll figure it out. Yeah, I can't tell if this is a stronghold or not. Like, my, my Eye of Ender definitely went into here, right? So we'll see what happens. I'll explore this place a little bit and let you guys know if anything cool comes up. So call me crazy, but doesn't this look like what would be an end portal? Like, look, this looks like an end portal here. And this looks like the lava that sits under the end portal. I found it on, JE, on, on Journey Map. So I'm kind of like just digging up to it. And oh, my goodness, I was correct. Haha, <laughs> nice. Yay, direwolf. I did the thing. Look at that. Cool. So you come here, single block. Haha. <laughs> Finding it on J yeah, or on Journey Map. That's what's up. That's how you do it, folks. That's how you do it. Loving it. Loving it. All right. Let's like fill this place back in. Yeah, no, that doesn't sound terrifying. Right, wireless out of range. No, not you. Dank null. You stay with me, friend. Alright, so your plan then was to have one of these. To have one of these. And portal. You're getting power. Nope, not terrified. Position 4 is now bound. For some reason it's called position 4. I don't know what that means, but whatever. Uh, you're going to get power. I'm going to let you get power for a few minutes. How do we make out on uh, on the luck here? Not terrible. We could use five more Eyes of Ender, and then we can head up to the end. Hooray! That would have been annoying to find had I not. I was literally, I think I was like over here-ish somewhere, and I was looking on, on Journey Map, and I'm like, hey, that looks like the end portal, doesn't it? Like, look, like what you're looking for is like a three by three of lava, and like that's how you know you found it, right? Especially having those like lighter colored blocks around it. Dude, super what's up. All right, cool. So let's pop home real quick. We're going to get the five eyes of Ender. Needs more Ender Pearls. Luckily, we have a mob farm for that. Cool. Five Eyes of Ender. Now we should be able to teleport back to here. Hooray! And then we can eat this. Who's ready to go to the end? Who's concerned that the end might be terrifying in this pack? Me. But I'm ready to teleport home if things go sideways. Okay? That's kind of my plan. If things go sideways, we're ready to teleport home. You ready? Geronimo! Cross my fingers. If we find Tungsten Ore, yay. At the very least, get me a bunch of Endstone. Uh, we're going to try to avoid the Ender Dragon for now, because who knows what that's all about, right? But finding the end, not the end of the world. Not a bad end portal spawn, right? Let's put, uh, let's put Endstone in here, shall we? Just a bunch of Endstone would be cool to snag. Again, no idea if there's actual tungsten here, but we'll keep our eyes out for it. That's cool. Right? What else we got going on here? We've got lapis ore. We've got end lapis ore and end lapis ore. Why do they look different? Dungeon tactics end lapis ore. Cyclic magic end lapis ore. Well, there you go. That's why. They are from two different mods, aren't they? Resonant Endstone? I don't mind snagging a little bit of you. Just remember that's going to teleport you if you let it touch you. Ooh, emeralds. Yes, please. Is that more Resonant Endstone stuff? Yeah. Hey, look, there's some kind of structure 
there. Is that interesting? There's that stuff, right? That's from that uh, Tinker's add-on style mod. What are you? Abyssium ore from Tinker's Alloying. Okay. I should I should at least try Tinker's Alloying a little bit, right? This is redstone ore. This is coal. So far, the end is not that terrifying. So far. So far, not that terrifying. Uh, what's this stuff? Palladium. And, and iron ore. Okay. I'd love to find the tungsten and the gold ore. Yeah. Would love to find the tungsten if it does exist. I don't know if it does exist or not. Like, I don't know if there's, I don't think there's a good way for me to find out if it exists, right? It may, it may not. What are you? Uh, and gold ore. Right, 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 right. So flight is definitely a nice thing to have. I ain't gonna lie about that. Dragon. Don't make me set up an automated way to kill you. Again. I did put Astral in the pack. I'm just saying. Sheldonite ore from Tech Reborn. Alright, well, I mean, it's, it's Tech Reborn, right? So, what's that process into? Platinum ingots. Okay, I'll take that. Platinum's, yes. Platinum is super rare, so that would be nice. This is coal ore. I would love to find tungsten. I'm gonna look underneath the platform, because that ain't, that, that's, you know, sometimes they spawn down here or something like that. Abyssium. That looked like more Abyssium. What's this stuff? Biome Essence Ore. Okay. That's coal. Just looked lighter than the other coal that we had found. And coal. And tungsten ore! Tungsten ore! We found it! We found it, y'all! Tungsten ore! Booyah! Booyah! Alright, let me find a little bit more of that stuff. Ooh, more emeralds. Yes, please. <laughs> right back. Oh, look, he's coming at me. Come at me, bro. I will automate your death. You know that's a thing Dara does. I'm not afraid to. Alright, more tungsten and we'll be uh, back. I'll meet you back at my base, unless anything interesting happens. Cool. Dimensional shard ore. Yes, please. Alright, let's make the most out of this tungsten, huh? Can we... Oh, we can. We can tungsten it. Do the thing, Tungsten. Give me triple. Yay, Tungsten. All right. So that means that we can get uh, what we need by way of this fancy drill to be fancyified. Uh, we need the energy flow conduit. Now we need the two Lapatronic crystals, which just need some energy crystals. So one, two. These aren't too bad to make, actually. Um, need more cable. Are really out of that stuff? Or did I leave that in here? Is that why? Yeah, I left it in here. That's why. Because we were working on other things. So what is it? Two cables per Lapatronic crystal? Okay. So we're going to need a little bit more cabling, I suspect. Let's get our tree tap. We're going to need at least one more of you, if not two. Now might not be a bad time to upgrade you to the batteryized version. Yeah, why don't we do that? I think that's a good plan, right? And then, now are you gonna get charged? Kind of? You've got 200 Forge Energy in you. Let's get a Tech Reborn battery if we can. Ugh, we're like completely out. Oh, he's kinda charging. Is he charging or what? First off, where is my doohickey? Did I leave him somewhere? There he is. Think you'll charge him? Now we're charged. That's what's up. All right, rubber ready. Uh, let's do the thing, All right? So now we wanted more of these things. Another one of you. And then now we are officially good to make this guy, right? Sweet. Energy flow conduits. 
yields this thing. Actually, that needed a that needed an iridium alloy plate, didn't it? Uh, let's make another crushed diamond. And some more TNT. I grabbed more gunpowder out of my uh, mob farm earlier. That's cool. All right, advanced power drill. Nice. All right, now we're getting somewhere, right? Now that, with end steel ingots, vibrant alloy ingots, and a chamber mark five will get me the power fist. So end steel as an alloy furnace with dimensional blend, which is four obsidian dust and crushed end stone, right? So we've got our end stone now. Hooray! And we've got our obsidian dust, right? So let's put you in a crusher probably would be the best way. No, wait, you need the, uh, let's do, I don't know. I'm, I lose track of which one. It always messes with me because crusher is not a crusher, right? Uh, I should really tick accelerate. I should really like augment these machines and do better with them. I've just done a really bad job of doing that, right? So, but at some point I will probably do better by way of these machines and make them properly upgraded so that we don't just come over here <coughs> and tick accelerate the things all the time. So there's that. There's this stuff, dimensional blend, sweet. Now do we have dark steel handy? We don't but we can get some uh, with some normal steel, right? Give me a little bit more steel. Uh, and what we're gonna do is throw that, let, let's actually teach this guy how to make dark steel. Dark steel ingots, you are going to be an alloy smeltery recipe of steel plus obsidian. That works for me. Okay, alloy smelter, boom, boom, boom. So give me like 10 of those bad boys and you should be cool. Nice. He's working on it. All right. While that's cooking, let's look at this chamber mark five dude that we need. So we need an octodic capacitor. We're actually really close to having what we need here. Um, but I remember making these was just like a long crafting process. So do we have electrical steel in there? No, we should probably teach that one as well. So electrical steel, can I get you in like a similar recipe? No, you're going to be always that, right? So you're going to be pulverized coal. I don't know if you know how to make pulverized coal, do you? Uh, is there a mechanism machine that can make that? The crusher from mechanism can. Okay, good. Right, you don't actually know how to do that? No. So which one of you guys is the crusher? Probably this dude. Nope, 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 nope. This dude is what I meant to click on. All right, cool. So give me like 10 of those, and that shouldn't be too bad. Nice. And we're cooking. That's not bad at all. All right, now dark steel needs to have another basic capacitor. Okay, so that would be this tier. And then you're gonna upgrade to the next tier with soul stuff. Solarium, let's teach you, right? Never hurts to teach a few more recipes while we're uh, getting to work here. So you're gonna go into the alloy smeltery. And meanwhile, I think what I'd like to do is teach you capacitors, because I know we're gonna need these in the future anyway. Right, you don't know how to make any of this yet. So why don't I teach that real fast? So that would be you, uh, you, and you. And I'm assuming that we don't yet have this recipe covered nor do we have this recipe covered, but now we do. And you can go in here, sir, along with you in the alloy smeltery. And you guys can go in the molecular assemblers, which at some, some point I should probably, you know, do better with. Uh, but, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll be all right. All right, so you, uh, we're definitely gonna need one of these and one of these. That shouldn't take too long to craft. And then in the meantime, we can get this ready to go as soon as this guy's done. 
Nice, 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 nice. That one's complete. Hey, don't be sneaking into my base, Mr. Husk. I'm working on stuff here. Cool, and there's the tier four. Now for the tier five, we get this. That is cool. We're getting there, guys. We are getting super close. So end steel is actually we could do the alloy smeltery with that recipe. What was this stuff for then? Oh, that was the alley furnace from Nuclear Craft. Oh, I was going to say, that recipe did not look right to me. But yeah, why don't I teach you how to make this? And steel, because I think we're going to need that in the future too. It was the wrong alloy furnace recipe. Let's put a bunch of end stone away. And then you can get end steel... I don't know, times six, let's say. Uh, so now the last thing we need is another vibrant alloy, and then we're 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 good to go, guys. We're good. We got it. We're done. That's it. That's it. We're done. Right? Last end steel cooks up, vibrant alloy cooks up, and we are ready to rock. That is cool. Now we have to figure out how to actually get upgrades in these things, and that involves Ratlantis. Hmm. Hmm, why you don't want to let me craft, buddy? It even puts the drill in there, so I know that's the right recipe. Looks like we're going to have to cheat it. it. Looks like we're going to have to cheat it. Uh, let's do this. Let's just, uh, yeah. We will cheat that in, and then we will cheat out the end steel, the vibrant alloy, and the advanced drill that we just made. I'm even gonna get rid of some other junk we don't need. <laughs> How's that look? Cool? All right, so with that said, now's a good wrapping up point for the episode. Uh, but we're gonna come back next episode, right? Press and hold the number of hotbar slot the power fist is in. Oh, cool, look at that. So hold this. I guess there's no modes available to me yet, but that's cool. Uh, neat, 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 neat. I really want to play with Machine Muse's modular power suits a little bit more. That said, we've reached a wrapping up point for the episode. So what we're going to do is come back next time. I think it's time to visit Ratlantis. I think it is. I have no idea what I'm in for for this dimension. I'm purposely not looking into it. But even as a, as a, as a teaser for next episode, what I'm going to do uh, is... Oh, I got a mushroom terrarium. Sweet. Do you actually do anything, or are you just cool looking? I think you're just cool looking. Cool. All right, so uh, what I'm going to do in advance of next episode is go in here uh, and chunky cheese token times one, please. What lottery? The lottery that's... What lottery? Are you stupid? Only lottery that matters. Uh, okay. Interesting. I don't get it. Sweet. So that's going to open up a portal. Right-click anywhere to open a portal to Ratlantis. <laughs> I don't know if that's like a permanent portal or like one that just kind of, you know, happens for a sec. I have no idea. Hey, look, there's a power armor helmet thingy over here on the right. I have no idea what that's about. I guess you've got power somehow. I don't know. Neat, though. We'll figure that out. For now, Dalton, I sign it off. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Uh, you know what to do. Take it easy.